Hello everyone, in this video we will create a, a React.js web application and we will connect it to Firebase real-time database and we will do crude operations on that data. We will read data, we will write data, update it and also delete it. So to do that, the first thing is of course to create a repo. Here, I will just create one and let's create it and then we will get the link and clone it to our computer. So open the command line and give clone link. That's it. And now let's open the directory of our parent folder. This is the project folder that we have just created. Go inside it and clear up the console. Now we can create our application. So npx create react app. Our React application is created. Now let's install a few more dependencies that we might need. One of them is React Router DOM. And the other one, the other ones are .env and also Firebase. It's finished. Now let's open the project in VS Code. So code, put a dot to the end. And now let's first make a cleanup, open the public folder, grab everything except index.html, delete them, open the source folder, app CSS, test JS, web vitals, logo SVG, tests JS again, and delete all of them. Open app JS, grab everything between do text here, type some random string, delete import statements. It's finished. Open index.js, delete all those lines and also this web vital line and close it and it's finished. Index CSS, we don't need this area, maybe for the font family Rebuche. And just choose a background color, a random background color. Let's choose rosy brown. Okay and go to index.html, delete all those link tags and this link tag and also this one also this no script and also you can say whatever your application name you want it to be and here put the description I will just leave it empty I mean like I'll have some random things but you should put a description here and also be better to put these two script tags they will help our project, once we deploy it to the internet, they will help our project not have a red React icon, which I mean is this. For example, this one does not have a red React icon because this website is already, you know, GitHub. And that's it actually. And let's make a test if everything works. npm start. Yes, it works. So that's it for this video. In the next video, we will start to uh, write some data to Firebase real-time database and we will create a React component for that and see you next time. Bye-bye.